What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Critical Overlord here. So we're going to be talking about IT Chapter 3 in this video here today. Better known as Welcome to Dare, the upcoming prequel series to Andy Muschietti's 2017 IT and 2019 sequel it chapter two it'll be the prequel series debuting on hbo max sometime next year i would imagine welcome to dairy is rumored to film from this upcoming may to december out in toronto but i could have sworn i saw another claim about it beginning production as early as next month the rest of this section of this video will just be rumors until you hear them confirmed by hbo max or those involved directly with the actual series but the first season is rumored to be anywhere from eight to ten episodes and the rumored plot details suggest that it will be set in the 1960s Welcome to Derry is rumored to follow four kids in a town bordering an Air Force base with a mysterious special projects bunker who search for a friend of theirs who disappeared mysteriously. The story centers on the origin story of Pennywise, the clown from the hit horror movie duology It and It Part 2, or It Chapter 2. Based on the character created by Stephen King, Pennywise is also the secondary antagonist of the Stephen King multiverse. Now, the official log line for the series that was reported from Variety last month that is actually official when as follows. Set in the world of Stephen King's It universe, Welcome to Dairy is based on King's It novel and expands the vision established by filmmaker Andy Muschietti in the feature films It and It Chapter 2. Andy Muschietti, who was responsible for the two films, Welcome to Dairy, will serve... Andy Muschietti, who, who was responsible for the first two films, Welcome to Dairy, serves as a prequel uh, that... He's returning to direct multiple episodes for the upcoming series is what I was trying to say, including the pilot and co-showrunner Jason Fuchs is writing the teleplay for the first episode of the series. Now, it's been long speculated if Bill Skarsgård will return to play Pennywise or not. And now we have an idea. Recently, in an interview with Jason's or with Jake's takes, Bill Skarsgård shared his shared his thoughts on the upcoming series and whether he would be back or not this is in a, again a recent interview from jake's takes i'll leave a link to it in the description uh he was being interviewed i think primarily about his role in john wick 4 but jake was able to ask bill about the upcoming it prequel series welcome to dairy and what it would take for him to return as pennywise and if not what advice he had to the next person to tackle the character scars gar said um yeah, yeah, we'll see what they come up with and what they do with it. As of now, I'm not currently involved in it. And if someone else gets to do it, uh, my advice to them would just be to make it your own and have fun with it. Now, that's the gist of what he said. So I know a lot of people listening to this, seeing the clip that I shared on Twitter, seeing it on any other platform that you may have come across this. This is like a gut wrench to you, especially if you're someone who already went through this last year with the bad news of what happened with jonathan breck and that whole scenario with the much muchly or overly accurately i would say hated jeepers creepers 4 and how he did not return as the creeper now i'm starting to see this kind of same sentiment spur up over bill skarsgård not being back as pennywise in the upcoming welcome to dairy series my thoughts on that are well one part of me thinks that his energy is being done in a way to hold it a secret until they actually announce it but another part of me wants to be mindful of the fact that well he also probably doesn't have a reason to lie unless again it's being kept secret until they announce it officially some people think that he won't be back um i'm inclined to say that i believe him as of now he's not currently involved but that doesn't of course mean things can't change maybe he just has yet to sign the dotted line to confirm his return but he's actually in negotiations with them maybe that's what's happening maybe he's not returning at all my thoughts are this this is the same type of energy i recall seeing when tim curry was being replaced by bill skarsgård himself and then bill skarsgård once everybody saw the makeup saw how he portrayed pennywise fell in love with what he brought to the table in it and it chapter two so if somebody else is going to be donning the makeup i I am open to it in, in all honesty i'm open to it uh i just think that what it comes down to is having good makeup and making sure that somebody can indeed make it their own like he is suggesting and try to not be too much like scars or to be too much like tim curry just be your own unique take on the character uh a part of me does think he'll be back though a part of me thinks he'll be back but i am gonna say that as of now i'm gonna believe him in what he's saying he's not involved as of now and he most likely will not return it, it's sad but it's not it's not the most shocking thing the longer we it went on without us knowing about it the more i was preparing for something like this but you guys can let me know down in the comment section below what you think about all of this are you 
happy Bill Skarsgård is not potentially returning? Do you think he might be trying to just keep it a secret? Or do you think that he is 100% not going to be back at all? Or do you just think, again, like I mentioned, he potentially just has not signed the dotted line to confirm all the deals that need to be in place? But again, let me know down in the comment section below. If you haven't already, of course, make sure you subscribe. Turn on post notifications at the this video. In the description, I'll have links on my social media accounts. I am on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. You can message me there, of course. Let me know if there's any movies, news, or reviews you'd like me to cover in the future. And with all that in mind, guys, I will see you in the next video.